everyone should be real on their resume because okay. uh, that is the one thing manager always looks into i have been working in global logic as a software developer Hi and welcome back to Coding Ninjas guys. I am Kabir Singh and we are here with another spectacular interview experience. So today we have Nikhil and we are going to discuss the interview experience of the company Global Logic. So let's finally get to it and see how the interview went, how many rounds were there and we'll brief out every round for you as we do in every interview experience. So I hope you like the video and let's get back to it. So hi Nikhil, how are you? Hi Kabir, I'm good. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. Nikhil, can you give me a small introduction about yourself and then we can finally hop into your interview experience? Sure, sure. So I am Nikhil. I have been working in Global Logic. as a software developer mm-hmm. and i've been working from the last one years in global okay. logic yeah. that's great okay so nikhil when you sat for the interview experience at global logic how many rounds were there so i had four rounds in global logic okay and uh, the first one is uh, like quiz round and okay. second round which is having around 120 minutes time difficulty level was good uh, for the first round then i had a technical round which is having all the technical questions of python okay. and sql mm-hmm. and the third round is a managerial round okay. in, in which the manager discuss about the projects and all Okay. And after that we had a HR round. Okay. Discussing the basic technicalities. Okay. So when we come back to the first round which you said was a quiz round, can you brief out what actually happened in that round and how many questions were there and what all yeah. happened in that? So it was a little typical down for me as because the questions are a little on a harder side. Mhm. So it is having around 40 questions. Okay. Three technical, three coding questions rest are mcq questions so okay. difficulty level of those quiz is like little on a harder side mm-hmm. and the coding questions are like little easy if you okay. if you ask me but the quiz questions are little difficult okay so you it. said 40 questions were there in total wherein three were yeah. the coding questions so 37 mcqs and three coding questions right yeah yes. okay and how many minutes were you given for this say it was around 120 minutes okay. in total okay you said the coding questions were easy and the mcq were hard So what is the final yeah. difficulty we can come up to was it a medium hard or something like that yeah you can say it is on a moderate level basically. okay on a moderate level yeah okay and how much time did you take to solve those questions like you completed it in 120 minutes yeah. only or you were able to do it earlier yeah it took me around uh, like one and a half hours total okay like solving the quiz and uh, the coding questions oh okay that's great so when we come up to the second round what actually happened in the technical round for you so the technical round is basically a one on one with a global logic team person uh-huh. so we had a zoom meeting Okay. So in which we, I have to turn on my camera, and he will be asking me few questions regarding the projects I have been working on and the things I have learned in Python. Okay. So from the technical respect, it was like on a moderate level because the questions was not that much hard and not that that much easy also. Okay. So it was on a good side. Uh huh. Okay. And uh, were you able to solve all the questions, or you missed out on some? Uh, not typically all the questions, but. Mm-hmm. Uh, like most of the questions i am able to give a correct answer on that that's nice okay and now hopping on to the third round what happened in that the managerial one yeah the third round in the manager round i had a long discussion with manager about what all task i have been working on Mm-hmm. And the project which I have worked on, so I okay. was going to know that what are my like role in that project, what all projects right. I have been working on, what mm-hmm. are my tasks in that. And apart from that, he was giving me a normal discussion about like what all qualities I have while working, what okay. all things, uh, what all technicalities I face. All okay. these things he was asking me. Okay. Yeah. And uh, Nikhil, since you cleared the managerial round, what is that one tip that you would like to give the viewers to, you know, always keep in mind when you're sitting for a managerial round specifically? Because you know, for the technical round, for the quiz and all, you need to have a good mm-hmm. hold on your basics, on your, you know, subjects to be precise. Yes. But when it's managerial round, you have to follow other aspects as well. So, what is that one thing where you have to be always, always cautious about when you're giving a managerial round? Like I feel everyone should be real on their resume because okay. uh, that is the one thing manager always looks into. Right. And when they are like uh, seeing a candidate, they first go through the resume only, and they will mm-hmm. find out if you have been working on certain projects. Right. So he gonna ask certain questions from that only. If okay. we are like making something up, then that time will be caught and it will not go in a good right. way. Right. Correct. So you have to be very precise what you're writing on your resume, and everything should yes. be the truth because you know. Yeah. Otherwise, it gets messed up. 
yeah it will mess up correct okay moving on to the final round what actually happened in that so that was a hr round so it was a normal conversation with the hr regarding the joining and all these details mm-hmm. and basic structure of the, the company and what all things are there in the company company policy and all were discussed in that okay so it was a chill round for me okay that's nice so yeah. now nikhil one good question for you is that including mm-hmm. these four rounds wherein there was a round mm-hmm. in the quiz where things were really hard there was a round with the hr which was really easy what would you rate the entire interview process was it really smooth or a little difficult you had ups and downs and all of that like it is on a moderate level because the first round is the one which i was expecting to be little easy right. and then it, the difficulty level should be going up but for me the first round was little difficult for me mm-hmm. so it was little hard but once it is like completed once it is like cleared from my side so i was a bit confident that i will be doing well in the next rounds that's really nice okay also guys i would like to inform you that nikhil has given a spectacular article as well for this interview experience so if you would like to read that article out i'll put the link in the description below because there you can find the actual questions that were asked to him in the interview so i would really appreciate if you you know go and have a look at the article and uh, maybe read it out and also solve the question so that you can also get placed in a company like global logic and uh, i really thank you nikhil for coming up and giving this spectacular interview experience and i hope yeah. to shoot another video with you pretty soon so thank, thank you so you. much thank you so much guys for watching this video if you like the video hit the like button and subscribe to coding ninjas i'll see you in the next one happy coding Thank you.